After years as an undocumented migrant in the United States, earlier this year Manuel Peña returned to Mexico City, his hometown. The atmosphere was horrible and people were becoming so xenophobic that I decided to return to Mexico. But upon arrival in the Mexican capital, like many other returning migrants, he didn't feel welcome. If you get a culture shock when you move there, it's a double culture shock when you return. It's very difficult to handle and many fall victim to drugs, suicide, criminal gangs. The way to survive is to find a community that accepts you. That's exactly what Manuel did with the help of a deportee support organization called New Comienzos, or New Beginnings. He's now one of the first inhabitants of a housing project it's named the ICE House, using its own acronym to flip the emotional response often elicited by Donald Trump's ICE, the US Immigration and Customs Enforcement Agency. For the Latino community in the States, the word ICE instills terror. It means rejection. So we sought to change the world's connotation and named this place the Incubador de Crecimiento y Éxito, the incubator of growth and success. With space for four residents, it's the first ever social housing project for deportees in Mexico City. Ben Moreno, a deportee himself, runs the project, which gives shelter and paid work opportunities to those who might otherwise be left on the streets. We help them out, we bring them in, and uh, other than just, it's not about just housing them here, it's, uh, it's helping them with their plans to further along and, uh, and, and pursue their, not just to pursue their dreams, but to be able to, um, to conquer their goals, whatever it is that they're pursuing. Leonila Romero, who runs a Mexico City migrant shelter, says projects like this are important for giving these at-risk communities the best chance in local society. I don't see them as foreigners, but as people who come here to enrich our country with their abilities and ambitions. And I'd like the rest of society to see them that way. But unfortunately, they are not considered and only treated with discrimination. New Comienzos says it aims to have five ice houses up and running by the end of the year, an achievement it hopes will result in a better future for this often marginalized community. Alastair Babastock, CGTN, Mexico City.